2020 is the year of the apple. Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK Vlogs. My name is MJ. That's a shopping vlogs, I suppose, isn't it? This is the launch video for 2020, which will be the year of the Apple on Food Review UK. For this launch video, I thought I'd just talk a little bit about what we're going to do this year and show you a look at Marks and Spencer, where they've got a fantastic range of apples. We are filming this in November 2019, so this is a bit of a time travel, but uh, they had such a great selection here that I really wanted to show it off. So really the most interesting find here is, look at this, they've got red flesh apples. Uh, so this is Kissabel. I will be doing a review of this, so I imagine I'll, I'll upload the review of this shortly after this launch video. But they're £2.30. Uh, they've also got this, which looks very interesting. I'm not going to pick it up today, but it's rocket apples. Uh, they're very firm. Now I like a nice crunchy crispy apple. Uh, these do look really nice. 250, they're quite small apples and apparently uh, grown exclusively for M&S. Um, I should mention as well, the, the, the Kissabel are very, very firm as well. So we have bought some of them. Uh, they've got your normal sort of stuff that you'd expect. Some organic apples like um, Royal Gala and Braeburn. They've got Pink Ladies, your Jazz. Currently sort of my favorite um, apple is a Jazz. Uh, russet, I, I believe I have had russet in my life, but I don't remember the exact flavour notes of it. As Claire just said, they taste like, uh, they look like pears rather. Uh, I think they tend to have like this scaly skin. Pears are over there as well, so similar. Uh, more russets there. Granny Smith's jazz, some nice big jazz there. What Claire describes as snow white apples, they are of course red delicious. They got cocks. I think cocks must be in season at the moment because you're seeing them in all the supermarkets. Isn't it, Claire? Now, I know this is the year of the apple and an apple video, but I really do have to just show the selection of um, sort of, uh, I suppose you'd call them tropical fruits. They got baby watermelons and you might think, oh, they're just not ripe ones. No, they've got, we've actually picked one up. Look at that yellow spot. Now that's where the fruit sits in the field spot, right? That's where the fruit sits in the field. You want to look for a large one and you want it to be deep in colour as well, yellow. So that means it actually it hasn't actually been picked early. It must be the variety. Um, so they've also got dragon fruit, which you would have seen in our basket as well. And they've got this, cherry moya. So I'm going to do a review of this. Cherry moya or cherry moya? Oh, Christ knows, Claire. I don't have a clue. Um, Sometimes called a custard apple, this creamy fruit has a distinctive sweet taste with hints of banana and coconut. Sounds incredible. Let's have a look at some more apples though. And then here's the rest of the apples. What have we got here? I think everything else we've got around the other side, but um, oh, British smitten. We didn't see them. British smitten. They're very hard. £2.20. Oh, they're really crisp actually. So that, yeah, that is, that is British smitten. I'd love, to, I'd love to get some more of these. The, the range of apples they've got here is tremendous. I guess last but by no means least, they've got Best of British the Ch from the Chandler family. What is the variety though? Oh, it is Eg Egremont. So it is like those other ones we were looking at. Yeah, Rus Russet. Oh yeah, Eg oh yeah, sorry. Egremont Russet. So that's it guys. Yeah, I can't believe it. 2020 is going to be the year of a fruit. Um, I can't imagine these videos are going to be particularly successful. <laughs> Yeah, but of a fruit. Apple, apple is a fruit. Um, I can't imagine these videos are going to be particularly successful in the slightest. But uh, hey, if you did enjoy it and if you're interested in apples, let me know in the comments below. We'll see you next time. Maybe write what your favourite apple is.